The Los Angeles Dodgers won three or four head-to-head -head games against the St. Louis Cardinals back in late March. Today, they kick off a three-game series from Busch Stadium, and we have a money-making opportunity on a team total. Hi, I'm Steve Seagrave from SportsMemo.com. If you guys enjoy the content and you know what to do, hit that like button, subscribe to the Wager Talk channel, and let us know who you got in the comments section, whether it be a side, a total, a player prop. I'll be checking those comments, getting back to you guys throughout the night. So we take a tough loss yesterday for our MLB video. My Red Sox could not do their part. We had over 8.5 for Red Sox Orioles. Baltimore prevails in that one 5-1. to one. But we're still doing great for our MLB August videos, 8-4. and four, And I'll take that type of a run any day. Today, though, we move on to Dodgers at Cardinals. First pitch, 8.15 p.m. Eastern from Busch Stadium. Game will be featured on the MLB Network. Dodgers negative 135 on the money line. Cardinals plus 114. Total sits pretty high at 9.5. And, and part of that is because the Dodgers are undecided as far as their starting pitcher goes right now. So we don't know who's pitching for them. This is going to be a little bit of a shorter video based on that. Uh, on the other side of things, it's Miles Michaelis. That's another reason why the total's high. Miles Michaelis, 8 and 9 on the year, 5 3 0. Oh. ERA 1.29 on the whip, and he's in bad form. He basically had identical starts on the road in his last two outings. Pitched exactly four innings only in both of them. He allowed eight hits in both of them. Only difference was five earned runs in one, four in the other. Those starts were against the Royals and the Cubs, and he's actually worse at home. He has a 4-5-4 a four, four ERA on the road. At home, that ERA blows all the way up to 6.38. And the Dodgers already crushed him when they faced him back in March. Uh, he only lasted four and a third, allowed seven hits and five earned runs in that one. Current Dodgers are crushing him, batting 3.20 against him with six home runs, a good sample size to 103 at bats. The big three has a lot to do with that. Mookie bats three for seven with a home run. Freddie Freeman, 8 for 17 with a home with three home runs. Otani hasn't hit a home run against him, but he's 4 for 5 with a double, so he sees him pretty well as well. And uh, even some of the lower-ranked Dodger hitters beat up on Michaelis. It's going to be a tough outing for him today. Guys, we still have the uh, buy three-day pass where you get four or eight days basically free. You get a seven-day pass, all access, over at sportsmemo.com for $49. It's essentially the same cost of a three-day pass normally, and that includes all plays, all sports, including 5% plays. We're back in action with the WNBA. We cashed our ticket last night on the hook. It was a it was a close one last night, but we cashed it, and we're now on a 6-0 WNBA run. Uh, we were nice and hot before the All-Star break. We know that we've been running hot in the MLB, raked in 40 units since July 1st in the MLB alone. We'll be back in action tomorrow night with NFL preseason as well. So all those plays will be included if you get one of these seven-day passes. Uh, it's only $49, and like I said, a normal cost of a 5% play is $29. So uh, there'll be a link attached to the pinned comment. To my, from A link from my sports memo page will be attached to the pinned comment. Uh, but back to the game that we're focusing on today. So the St. Louis pen is middle-of-the-road numbers-wise. But it's actually a bullpen that I think is pretty good. So I'm really going to focus in here on, on beating up on Michaelis. The Dodgers have done a good job on it. So we'll hope that they do it again today. The Dodgers are a top five lineup on the season. WRC plus, on base percentage, ISO, uh, walk rate. He doesn't walk a lot of guys, but they've beaten up on Michaelis hit-wise anyway. But Dodgers top five against right-handed pitching all season long. They have cooled off over the last 30 days, but a lot of that was without Mookie Betts in the lineup. Now, Mookie is back, and he's uh, that just makes all the difference in this lineup. They're able to do the thing where they, they, go, they go right, left, right, left, right, left, right down the lineup, and it makes it really tough for any sort of pitcher to deal with those big three bats. Michaelis has struggled against them in the past, so the Dodgers' first five team total is only 2.5 at negative 120, their full game team total. Is sitting at five and a half at plus money. Let's go Dodgers team total in the first five here. Focus on Michaelis alone. We don't have to worry about the other side of things. I think the Dodgers get to him and beat him up early. 
We could see this one cashed, I think, in the first two or three innings. So Dodgers team total over two and a half in the first five innings is our official play. Like I said, the link to my Sports Memo page will be in the pinned comment. I always have free plays posted at sportsmemo.com, as well as Twitter or X at stevesbook22. On the way out, hit the like button for me. And we're doing Dodgers-Cardinals again for Saturday. So I'll see you guys then. Good luck tonight.